Hi boys and girls, for lesson six in math today, you're going to need to cut out these shapes. So I wanted to demonstrate that for you because it could be quite difficult if you don't do it correctly. Let me shut this light off. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna wanna do, let me get this focused, let that focus in. All right, the first thing that you're gonna wanna do, I'm gonna decrease the size, is you're going to want to cut this shape in half from corner to corner and that's going to leave you with two triangles and you're going to put those aside you don't need those yet if you look at the shape that you have left you have a big triangle if they're put together you have a smaller triangle here and here a square another triangle and a parallelogram if I close this off, the shape that I'm seeing right here is a trapezoid. Okay, so that might be a new shape name to you, a trapezoid. So the next piece I should cut is this other triangle right here, because that way I don't have to work around the, all these crazy lines, and it's going to give me nice straight shapes, because I'm going to put them together. All right, so I've got that triangle. Now I'm just going to turn it, and I'm going to start at the end. I'm going to snip this piece and it gives me another triangle. Then I'm going to snip my square. All right. And then I have two shapes left. I'm going to snip that last triangle. And there we go. So then I'm going to come back over to this big triangle and I'm going to cut it into two pieces. And what we're going to be doing in this lesson today is we're going to be building composite shapes. Well, composite shape is just a fancy way of saying making other shapes from shapes that you already know. Like again, this is a parallelogram, a square, and we have all these triangles. All together, can you see how many pieces we have? That's right, we have seven pieces. So if I start to take these seven pieces, and a lot of times you might have seen these as it's called, they're called tangrams. I can take my composite, I can take my real shapes, and now I put them together and I've made a square. I can put this triangle on top, whoops, and I can put this triangle over, I can put this parallelogram over here. I can do whatever I want, but this whole thing is called a composite shape, and a composite shape is made out of known shapes to you. You know that these are different kinds of shapes. I can make another composite shape. I can make a composite shape that looks like this. I can make a composite shape that looks like this. It almost looks like a flag or a boat. All right, but that's what our lesson's gonna be today. And so you can have lots of fun doing that. But if you don't cut this correctly, it can be very frustrating as it won't work for you. All the, piece, all the pieces will be all cut funny and won't work. So hopefully that helps you get ready for your lesson today. And um, I'll be seeing you at the Zoom meeting later. Here we go.